same thing trigonometric ratios of well known angles we have seen the values how to find the values of well known angles trigonometric ratios of well known angles we were doing problems i have done a couple of problems in the previous video i am doing some more problems for the benefit of students in this video now 9sc01m question paper of april may april may 2017 17 section c a five marks problem uh problem number 25 problem number 25 show that show that sin 30 sin 30 degree cos 60 degree sin 30 cos 60 degree plus cos 30 sin 60 degree cos 30 sin 60 degree minus sin 90 is equal to 0 without using table or calculator this is the problem okay okay now sin 30 is 1 by 2 into cos 60 is root 3 by 2 plus cos 30 is root 3 by cos 30 is 1 by 2 to sin 60 is root 3 by 2 minus sin 90 is 1 so it will be root 3 by 4 root 3 by 4 plus plus this is also root 3 by 4 minus 1 sin 90 is 1 now the lcm is 4 so root 3 plus root 3 minus 4 Two root three minus four divided by four. Here two can be taken out as common factor. Root three minus two divided by four. Two ones are two twos are. So it will be root three minus two divided by two. This is the answer. This problem seems to be wrong. Sine thirty is half. Cos sixty is root three by two. Cos 60 is root 3 by 2. Cos 30 is half. Sin 30 is half, correct? Cos 60 is cos 60 is sorry, I have made a mistake. This is half. This is half. Cos 30 is root 3 by 2, and sin 30 60 is root 3 by 2, correct? So I have made a mistake. Because I have not used that, so one by four plus three by four minus one. One by four plus three by four is one. This will be one. You can take the LCM. Four is the LCM. One plus three minus one. One plus three by four means four by four. One minus one that is zero. Right. This is the correct way of doing it. The problem is not wrong. I had made a mistake. The problem is correct. Okay. Next. 
we'll take some more problems this is april may 2016 2016 section c problem number 3 section c problem number 3 section c problem number 3 uh without using table or calculator find the value of 4 sin square 45 degree 4 sin square 45 degree plus 16 16 sin square 30 degree sin square 30 degree minus tan square 45 degree into cos square 0 degree find the value of this without using table or calculator sin 45 will be 1 by root 2 so 4 into 1 by root 2 the whole square plus 16 into sin 30 sin 30 will be 1 by 2 whole square Minus tan forty five is one one square. Cos zero is one, so one square. Cos zero is one. So four into this will be one by two plus sixteen into one by four minus one into one. Two ones are two, two twos are four, four ones are four, four fours are sixteen. So it will be two plus four minus one. Two plus four is six. Six minus one is five. This is the value of this. We have found out without using either table or calculator. November, December two thousand fifteen. November, December two thousand fifteen. November December 2015 section C again section 3 here yeah? section 3 a uh, simplify without using table or calculator sin square 60 degree sin square 60 degree problem number 3 this is 3 4 He says simplify sine square sixty degree uh, cos square thirty degree cos square thirty degree plus tan square sixty degree tan square sixty degree into cot square thirty degree. Cos square thirty degree. Sine sixty is root three by two. Sine sixty is root three by two. So sine square sixty will be root three by two the whole square. Cos thirty is again root three by two. Root three by two. Cos square will be this square plus tan square sixty. Tan square sixty that is root three whole square. Cot square thirty. Cot square thirty. Cot square thirty will be 
and then root 3, root 3 square. So this will be 3 by 4, root 3 square means 3, 3 by 4 into 3 by 4 plus root 3 square is 3 into root 3 square is 3. So it will be 9 by 16 plus 9. So this is 16 is the LCM, 9 here plus 16 into 9 that is 144. 153 divided by 60. That is the value of this. You have to leave it like that. You need not further simplify it. It will be like that. Next. April, May 2015. April, May 2015. Section C, April May 2015, Section C, Problem number 3C, Problem number 3C. C in section C find the value of 4 find the value of 4 sin square pi by 4 sin square pi by 4 plus 16 sin cube pi by 4 into cos square 0 0 degree cos square 0 degree now here this 4 will be as it is number sin square instead of pi by 4 you can write it as 45 degree plus 16 sin cube this is also 45 degree into cos square 0. So 4 into sin 45 is 1 by root 2 the whole square because it is sin square plus 16 into sin cube 45. Sin 45 is 1 by root 2 whole cube into cos 0 is 1 1 square. So this will be 4 into square of this will be 1 by 2 plus 16. This will be 1 by 2 root 2. Root 2 cube means root 2 into root 2 into root 2. So that will be 2 root 2 into 1. 1 square will be 1 only that doesn't matter. 2 1s are 2, 2 2s are 4. 2 1s are 2, 2 8s are 16. So it will be 2 plus 8 by root 2. You can leave it like that or you can take LCM here. So it will be 2 root 2 plus 8 divided by root 2. This will be the answer. That will be the answer there. 5 marks for that. November, December 2014. December 2014 Section C Section C uh, 
find the value of sin 60 this is problem number 3 problem number 3 in section C sin 60 cos 30 sin 60 cos 30 30 degrees plus sin 45 cos 45 sin 45 cos 45 so this value you have to find sin 60 root 3 by 2 into cos 30 root 3 by 2 plus sin 45 1 1 1 by root 2 1 by root 2 cos 45 is also 1 by root 2 so root 3 into root 3 is 3 2 into 2 is 4 plus 1 by root 2 into 1 into 1 is 1 root 2 into root 2 is 2 so now the LCM is 4 here 4 1s are 4, 3 1s are 3 2 2s are 4, 2 1s are 2 so the answer is 5 by 2 that's it that's all, 5 marks for that 5 marks are awarded for that if you do it correctly it now April May 2014 next April May 2014 section C section C uh, question number 3 find the value of cos square pi by 4 cos square pi by 4 minus cos square 30 30 degree plus sine to the power of 4 sine to the power of 4 pi by 6 radians plus sine to the power of 4 sine to the power of 4 60 degrees so this can be written as cos square 45 degree cos square 45 degree pi by 4 means 45 degree pi by 2 is 90 so pi by 4 will be half of that 45 degrees cos square 30 degree plus sin to the power of 4 pi by 6 is 30 degree plus sin to the power of 4 60 degree cos 45 is 1 by root 2 the whole square minus cos 30 is root 3 by 2 the whole square plus sin to the power of 4 30 degree sin 30 is 1 by 2 1 by 2 whole to the power of 4 plus sin 60 root 3 by 2 root 3 by 2 whole to the power of 4 so here it will be 1 by 2 square of square of root 2 is 2 minus 3 by 4 plus 2 to the power of 4 is 16 so 1 by 16 plus 3 to the power root 3 to the power of 4 means it will be 9 it will be 81 3 to the power of 4 is 81 3 into 3 into 3 into 3 4 times it will be 81 square root of 81 will be 9 divided by 2 square is uh, 2 to the power of 4 is 60 so the LCM here is 16 2 8s are 16 8 will come here 8 into 1 is 8 minus 4 4s are 16 4 3s are 12 plus 
sixty one zero, so it will be one 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 zero one plus sixty one zero. Eight plus one nine, nine plus nine eighteen, eighteen minus twelve is six divided by sixty two by three by two and three by eight. It will be three by eight. Two three sir, two eight sir. Three by eight is the answer, final answer. Right. Next, I am taking November December two thousand thirteen. November. December two thousand thirteen. Prove that prove that ten square thirty. Degree tan square thirty degree plus sine square forty five degree sine square forty five degree plus cos square sixty degree cos square sixty degree plus cos square ninety degree. Cos square ninety degree is equal to thirteen by twelve. You have to prove that this value of that is thirteen by twelve. So take the left hand side. Tan square thirty plus sine square forty five degree plus cos square sixty degree plus cos square ninety. That's the problem. Tan thirty. Tan thirty is one by root three. One by root three square of that because it is tan square. Sine forty five is one by root two square of that plus cos sixty is cos sixty is one by two. Square of that plus cos ninety is zero. Cos ninety is zero zero square. So this is one square is one only. Root three square is three plus one by two plus one by four. This can be omitted. Zero. Now the LCM here is twelve. Three fours are twelve. Four ones are four. Plus two six are twelve. Six ones are six. Four threes are twelve. Three ones are three. Four plus six is ten. Ten plus three is thirteen by twelve. That is the right answer. We got the right answer. Thirteen by twelve. ब्रेक कर सकते हैं नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट आई एम टेकिंग ए प्रॉब्लम फ्रॉम अप्रैल मे टू थाउजेंड थर्टीन April May 2013. We are all in section C. Section C. Problem number three. Find the simplified value of sine square pi by three. Into tan square. Pi by four plus cos square pi by six, cos 
cos square pi by 6 into cos square pi by 3. So you take you convert this this into degrees. Sin square pi by 3 means 180 by 3, it becomes 60 degree. Pi by 4 means 45 degree. 180 by 4 is 45 degree. Pi by 6 means 30 degree. Cos square 30 degree. Pi by 3 means 60 degree. 180 by 3 is 60 degree. So, now, sin 60. Sin 60 is root 3 by 2. Root 3 by 2, the whole square. Tan square 45 is 1. Tan 45 is 1. So, 1 square plus cos square 30 is cos 30 is root 3 by 2 whole square. Cos square 60. Cos 60 is cos 30 is root 3 by 2. Cos 60 is 1 by 2. 1 by 2 the whole square. So this will be 3 by 4 into 1 plus this will be 3 by 4 into 1 by 4. 1 by 4. So 3 by 4 plus 3 by 16. 16 is the LCM. 4 fours are 16, 4 threes are 12. 16 ones are 1, threes are 3. So it will be 15 by 16. This is the answer. This is the value of that. 15 by 16. I hope you have understood this. Please like, share, comment and subscribe the channel. Thank you.